Hi, my name is Meek and I'm 11 years old. Today I'm going to show you how to solve the mirror cube. As you can see, there's three layers. The small layer, the medium layer, and the large layer. And it's very hard, as you can see, the, like it confuses people like this. But it's actually fairly similar to the 3x3. Three three. As you can see, if we do this, if we do like one move like this, we do this. You can see if you do it with a three by three, it's the exact same thing. It changes the middle cubes. But then it goes very hard how to fix it. So I'm gonna show you how to solve this one. If you have one that's no branded, that means if you see the large one was like this, the smallest one is like this. I like to start with the smallest one because, because it's easier now. So with the three by three, you first solve the white cube, which is fairly easy. You first connect the colors and colors like this. You have to do the same thing with this one also. First, you need to find like these small piece. Wait. Yeah, you need to find these small pieces and try to connect to the large one, which is here. You try to connect it to the one with the smallest side which is this side, the smallest one with the large side. Then you do with the next ones. If you can find them. Then we can do with the other ones. The last but not least, the last one. With the next one, as you can see, there's corners you need to fix. So with this one, you can fix the corners with this. Then you can use this. Like colors, the type colors match, similar to the to the mirror cube. So in this one, since we finished the, the cross, now we can use the method with this one to find this. But it's very hard because, as you can see, sizes vary from each side. So whenever I find the corner piece, I try to push it up and see if it aligns. Then I can use it. See if it line, then it works. Then, you, then the last one is very, very, very easy because you don't have to switch with another one. Then boom. One side down. Then now the next side, as you can see, the now you need to fix this one. As you can see, you can need to fix this ones to these. So it's very similar. And you can do it with the rest of them. With the other ones. And the last one. It'll work with this one also. First, I try to check, and plus, if you see this one like connects with this, that means it won't go on these four pieces. So the ones with the shortest one will go with the shortest ones, go in the, these sides. Maybe you find another one. Again. See this, you can do this side again, and once you finish this one with this one, 
Now we finish the last side. Now with the final side, you first need to find this thing, or so you do this to get, or you can have this one, which you need to do this one again to get the um the middle cross, the top cross. So we can do this with this one. F R U R B U R F R. It's a formula. Then we can do it again if it does not make the cross. And then done. It made the cross. Now with this one, we need to make this one. Will it actually sort of actually happen before? But if we, it doesn't work, you have to like, you have to do the formula R U 2 R bar U bar R U bar R bar. Get it work. So now we have to do with this one. The best strat is to find two of them, which they connect like these. But we didn't find one, but only this one connects like this. Then you do F R R R Oh, I forgot about this one. I did a mistake, but I can fix it now. Then I can fix this side now. Which is in the wrong space. If you do this, you have to do the ex exact same way with another one. And then go again. Okay, we're back to here. Now we're done here. As you can see, after you finish all these, now I actually found these two. After you found these, this one and this one connect, you have to go to the side where this one's connected. And then you do the formula R U 2 R bar U bar R U bar R bar. Done. And then I, you have to do the. After you finish this, you find a side that's like this. And then if you don't find anyone, you have to do the. And it works until you have all of these connected. With the 3x3, three three, all of them will be connected like this. Now with this one, it will be very hard to know which one's connected. So we have to do mostly lots of times until I find one that is connected. If it's not connected, I just do it again until I find the one that's connected. That means... I can see if it's fairly connected if I just do the, the last one. So it works. So I'm gonna do this again. So now the last one, you just need to do R bar, D bar, R, D, R bar, D bar, R, D. R B R D R B R D for the rest of them. And now you have to do fairly similar to this one. R B D R R D R B D R R D R B D R R D R B D R R D R B D R R D R B D R R D. Now we finish this. So you, you can see that it's fairly similar with the 3x3 three three, as I can show you. It's solved that the same way. Okay, give me a smile now. Thank you and have a very nice day. Like and subscribe.